Iris, of course, hasn't just damaged the health of thousands of our neighbors. It's led to real financial problems for many. The city received millions of dollars from the government to help those in need. And KMAX Matthew Stell joins us tonight with a look at where that money went. Yeah, Brian, Lubbock City Manager Jared Atkinson does not talk much on camera, but he did spend some time today walking me through where all of our CARES Act dollars have gone and why they went where they did. When Congress passed the $2 trillion CARES Act back in March, over $300 billion of that went to state and local governments that had to spend it by the end of the year. So what did Lubbock do with all those dollars? The city of Lubbock received an allocation of just a little over $14.1 million. City Manager Jared Atkinson says the money got split a few different ways. First off, Congress told cities to use 20% of their care dollars to help people directly. So for Lubbock, that was an untouchable block of $2.8 million. Making funds available for child care assistance, utility assistance, rent and mortgage assistance, and then what we call the micro grant program, which again was a, a direct um, small grant to people who were directly negatively affected. Atkinson says the city felt like that just wasn't enough to help folks. So they went ahead and added 400,000 extra dollars. The city council then on top of that uh, approved allowing us to spend um, basically out of our reserves, out of our savings account. Um, that is the money in the, in the total of just under $3.2 million. That money was directly paid to the city. The remaining $10.9 million, which went to more protective equipment, police and fire department expenses, and public health education will have to be reimbursed. We've received collectively about $7.8 million of that back, so it's our reimbursement. Um, and there's a little over $6.3 million then that are outstanding. And Atkinson says the money's all gone, but wishes that Lubbock may have gotten a few more dollars, especially when compared to a city like Austin, who got over three times more than Lubbock did. City of Lubbock's allocation was based on $55 per capita. So you multiply the population 55, and you come up with the 14.1. Certainly, I, I don't think the need here is any less. It was just what we were able to get. We're thankful we got it. And while all that money has been spent, if you still feel like you need some more assistance with your rent or utilities, you can call the city at 311. Brian. All right, Matthew, thank you so much.